If you're a selfie aficionado and have been waiting for the right camera to upgrade from your smartphone, then Olympus has a solution for you. It's called the Penlight EPL7. I'm Lexi Savides from CNET. I'm going to take you on a first look through the camera and a couple of its features. If you're familiar with any of the old Olympus Pen cameras, then the EPL7 won't come as much of a surprise to you. But if you're a newbie to it and you love your selfies, this camera is designed specifically for you because it has a touchscreen that comes down 180 degrees below the lens, like so. Now, Olympus has told me that this is because when the camera screen is below the lens, you're more likely to make it look like you're actually looking in the lens, even when you're checking yourself out. So I'm gonna test this out. Here's me looking normally into the lens, and here's me looking into the screen, checking myself out. As you can see, it looks like I'm staring into the lens for both of those photos. So Olympus, I'll give you this one. Elsewhere on the spec sheet, it is quite similar to the EPL5 camera from a couple of years ago. You get a live MOS sensor, 16.1 megapixels, so the same resolution, interchangeable lenses and a three axis image stabilizer, which is pretty handy if you're holding the camera out at arm's length, taking all of those selfies. Elsewhere, you get full manual controls plus Olympus's art filters. There are two extra ones included this time, a vintage color effect, as well as a partial color effect and this will also show on the screen when you're taking a photo in this mode the color wheel so you can choose which color you want to emphasize and make pop against a monochrome background of course you get full HD video recording at 1080p However, you don't get many selectable frame options. Actually, you don't get any at all. But fortunately, you do have some other controls such as manual exposure and audio controls. Connectivity is via Wi-Fi and the setup is pretty simple. All you have to do is take a photo of the QR code on the back of the camera screen with your smartphone or tablet and this establishes the connection with the app. On top of all that, you get in-camera HDR, a live composite mode for long exposures, and fast continuous shooting at eight frames a second. The maximum shutter speed is also one four thousandth of a second, which is not as fast as a pro DSLR, but it's pretty good nonetheless. Flash is not included in the camera body, unfortunately. You have to actually remove this on the hot shoe, this little port, and then attach the included external flash, which you can also tilt up and bounce around as required. This has been a first look at the Olympus Penlight EPL7. Check out heaps more specs, a photo gallery, and more over at CNET.